Well, this is serious. <laughs> this is tips in the go. This is serious work right here. Okay. So we're on our way to a wedding right now. So we are uh, an hour twenty, an hour and twenty minutes early right now. So we are we're about an hour and twenty minutes early. Cause I mean, you know, we're gonna be that early. The reason why I do that is because you need to give yourself time you know you need to give yourself time to travel you need to anticipate anything that happens on the road maybe there's, there's a detour maybe there's like a 30, 30 minute detour there's an uh, an accident there there's road work you know stuff like that so you know unexpected stuff especially if you're filming a wedding out of town like let's say it's three hours away from where you live or an hour two hours away you need to give yourself at least an hour and change for you to travel. So that's what I always do. I always give myself an hour and change to travel. Um, if the wedding is, you know, like two hours. like So I'm going to Kissimmee, Orlando right now. Um, you know. So, yeah. So I'm going to get there at 12.43 p.m. But I'm supposed to be there at 2 p.m. So, you know, I have that time to like, you know. Uh, if there's anything on the road that happens, you know, I get to have some extra time um, You know, so that's why I always do that and if I gotta get some food or if I gotta get some gas and all that stuff So I'm just telling you guys that is that a cop? No, it's not I'm just telling you I'm just telling you, you know, if you get if you get pulled over at least you got, you know, time to get that ticket and be on your way <laughs> But if you're just like two minutes away from when you gotta get there Another thing is like, like um, let's say some weddings start whereby you're just gonna start with the ceremony. Like our wedding today, we're starting at the ceremony. So 2 p.m. is the ceremony. So you need to get there extra early because like they're not gonna hold up the ceremony for you. You know, I don't know who you think you are, but they're not gonna hold up the ceremony for you. I did this one wedding where I was late, 35 minutes, and um. When I got there, the ceremony was already done. Yeah, and the bride, everybody at the wedding was just like looking at me like like I'm shit, you know? But um, yeah, I managed to still do the wedding, but it was just an awkward. There was um, there was an accident on the turnpike. And uh, I got caught up for like an hour on that thing and I, I was late, so it happens. But see, it's good to always, like, at least have leave time for things like that, to anticipate things like that, you know? So I don't want to drag the video because this is tips on the go. It's just like we're on the go right now. We're in transit. But what I'm trying to say is, like, leave, like, leave a lot of room for error, you know? Especially if you are going fur, fur, really. If you're, going, <laughs> if you're going further out than where you stay, where you live. So, yeah, that's that. Big baby.